Sanctuary state vote, Californians give Governor Brown the worst news of his career. By Adam Casalino, Politics U.S. News from AdWorldNews.com. This week, Los Alamitos voted to reject California's sanctuary law. Now, other cities are beginning to respond to the historic move hitting Governor Jerry Brown with what some people are calling the worst news of his political career. It's over for him. Yeah, enough is enough. The state of California shocked the nation when Governor Jerry Brown signed the sanctuary law. This piece of legislation forbids local law enforcement from helping federal authorities. It prevents police from handing over violent criminals to the federal government, all because they are illegal immigrants. The leaders of California have declared that they care more about illegal aliens than American citizens, but not everyone in the state agrees. Los Alamitos voted this week to reject the law, citing that it violates their oath to uphold the U.S. Constitution. All things considered, that's a pretty good reason to reject the law. The historic vote has people across the country talking. Many in California have formed their own opinions. The liberal media would have you believe that the rest of the state is outraged at uh, Los Alamitos, but that couldn't be further from the truth. Yeah, just like when they said people wanted Hillary to be president. You see, the media is working against what we the people want. As it turns out, numerous cities are considering opting out as well. In a very short order, we might have many regions in California that reject the sanctuary law. There you have it, the people who are paying the taxes over there and living in uh, with uh, all this uh, garbage all around. Uh, the county of Orange and several cities in Southern California soon might join Los Alamitos. They will join Los Alamitos in its bid to opt out of a controversial state law that limits cooperation with federal immigration officials. Officials with the county as well as leaders in Aliso Viejo and Buena, uh, Buena Park uh, said uh, Tuesday they plan to push for various versions of the anti-sanctuary ordinance approved in Los Alamitos. Uh, late Monday by a four to one vote of that city council. There's a pretty good amount of cities uh, interested and they want to know about the process, said Los Alamitos Mayor Troy Edgar, who spent Tuesday fielding calls and emails from officials and other cities and other in others interested in the push, source Orange County Register. To the casual observer, this might be a startling sequence of events, but it comes as no surprise to those of us who are paying attention. While uh, California's leaders are reckless and treasonous, there are many patriotic citizens in the state. They are outraged over the radical direction Brown and his lawmakers are taking California. They have put toxic policy ahead of the basic needs of their people. Their sanctuary laws in the latest is a, a series of bad movies that put American citizens at risk. Meanwhile, the state still suffers from recent wildfires and mudslides. Expert pre experts predict another coming drought. Uh, but Brown is more concerned with putting criminal aliens back on the streets. Los Alamitos, along with these other cities, do not want illegal aliens wreaking havoc in their communities. The list of other cities considering a similar vote is growing. Orange County Supervisor Michael Steele said in a statement Tuesday that she plans to present a similar ordinance in the Board of Supervisors. Aliso Viejo uh, Mayor uh, da uh, Dave Harrington said his council would dis will discuss similar action next month. Buena Park C Councilwoman Beth Swift said she will follow the lead as well and will request a discussion on the measure at the next council meeting. Huntington Beach had uh, been considering opting out of the state sanctuary law even before Los Alamitos' decision, Assemblyman Allen 
uh, told the publication source Fox News. More will be added to the list in short order while Jerry Brown and his cronies enjoy peace and safety in their gated mansions. The rest of the state suffers from unchecked illegal immigration. These cities and counties have been uh, have seen the damage caused by drug cartels and criminals. To have their governor defy the federal government like this is an insult to every hard-working resident. Of course, California's socialist regime isn't taking this lying down as usual. They cast conservatives who oppose them as racist. Call me racist, that's all. Uh, enough is enough, that's what I would say. California State uh, Senate leader Kevin DeLeon, who uh, authored the controversial sanctuary law and is aiming for U.S. Senator Dianne Feinstein's seat, another uh, liberal idiot, uh, saw the law doesn't violate the Constitution and those councils opting out of it are risking to be sued. Really? The Los Alamitos Council's symbolic vote in favor of President Trump's racist immigration enforcement policies is disappointing, De Leon uh, told the Ventura County Star source Fox News. Who's paying your salary, I'd like to know, uh, De Leon? Is it the law-abiding citizens that are pay paying your salary, or is it the illegals that are paying your salary? I say people of California should not take this crap anymore. Much like a boy who cried wolf, liberals constantly calling conservatives racist is getting tired, right? And pointless. There are clear reasons why we cannot allow illegal immigration in our country. Democrats have zero excuses for defending criminal behavior. And they can uh, do, all they can do is throw insults. That's all they have, throwing insults. Don't be surprised to learn about more cities rejecting the sanctuary law. This will soon snowball across the, st uh, the state. Yeah, that's how come Trump won, because it snowballed. And Trump won because people are sick of the same old, same old. And uh, Governor Jerry Brown and uh, De Leon is in for a rude awakening. A rude awakening once these California people are starting to rise up against their uh, rhetoric, against uh, uh, all this uh, being racist and everything else, right? Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And again, thank you so much for watching.